was a long time ago, longer now than it seems, in a place that perhaps you've seen in your dreams. For the story you are about to be told began with the holiday worlds of old. I know you're curious to see what's inside. It's what happens when two holidays collide. Welcome, my friends, to our Christmas delight. Come witness a ghoulishly glorious sight. It's time for our holiday tale to begin. There's no turning back now. Please, come all the way in. Our holiday tale is a tale that's quite charming. But during this season, it's sometimes alarming. So relax and reflect. Feel free to take pause while we tell you the tale about dear Sandy Claus. Twas the nightmare before Christmas, and all through the house, not a creature was peaceful, not even a mouse. The stockings, all hung by the chimney with care, when opened that morning, would cause such a scare. The children, nestled all snug in their beds, would have nightmares of monsters and skeleton heads. <laughs> now, hurry along. As they say, look alive. This is one holiday you will want to survive. Jack Skellington came here from Halloween Town. You'll notice his handiwork scattered around. This year, he's decided to play Sandy Claus, but when Halloween creates Christmas, you might see some flaws. And now, a dark carriage will take you away. Sit back, rest in peace in your black Christmas sleigh. Your sleigh will accommodate one or two more. We hope you're prepared for what Jack has in store. Do not pull down the bar it will float down with ease. And remember, no flash photography, please. Yes, down through the chimney, Jack flew like a bat, clutching his magical Sandy Claus sack. He ripped open the sack, and in moments, it seems, created a Christmas you have in bad dreams. More rapid than vultures, the mansion was changed. All was soon covered, Adored and deranged. And what to your wondering eyes disappears? It's Jack's little friend Zero. The ghost dog reindeer. Nothing here was forgotten. It all looks so pleasant. A coffin, Jack says, makes a fine Christmas present. A man-eating plant makes a wonderful wreath. As long as you don't get caught in its teeth. Jack's holiday vision was unlike no other. So, ring out the bells. There's more cheer to uncover. With some treats and some games, you can make a scene merry. Why, even a gingerbread house could seem scary. All at once, happy haunts did materialize like a nightmarish painting by Career and Ives. A bag full of toys Jack had slung on his back. They were strange and bizarre and on the attack. Sandy Claus worked his magic both outside and in. But one final touch made his bony face grin. Now what better gift on my friends to bestow than a graveyard that's covered in ghostly white snow? As Jack sprang to his sleigh, three hitchhikers he spied. They said, Sandy Claus, may we please have a ride? But Jack waved goodbye, for he just could not stay. He had much to deliver before Christmas Day. May Jack's ghostly presence now follow you home, and stay in your hearts wherever you may roam. For now you know what happens when holidays meet. You might get a trick or a holiday treat.